10 powerful prayer points for your August 2023. I will give you the keys of the kingdom of heaven. Whatever you bind on earth will be bound in heaven. And whatever you lose on earth will be loosed in heaven. Matthew 16, 19. Dear listener, I come to you in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, who died on the cross for our salvation. I welcome you to the month of August 2023. Grace and peace be multiplied unto you. I ask that you join me in this prayer for the next 15 minutes as we consecrate the next 30 days into the hands of the Lord. Put your phones on silent and focus on this prayer. Repeat every word after me and have faith that the Lord of hosts will answer your prayers for he says in his word that every prayer made in his name will be answered. The Bible also says in the book of Psalms that the all-knowing God foreknows our words before we speak. The good book also advises us that men ought always to pray. Set aside this time with the Lord. Here are 10 simple prayer points for August. Prayer point number one. Dear God, I start by thanking you for this new month. Thank you for the gift of my family. I declare financial abundance flowing into my life like never before. I attract opportunities, success, and positive energy. I am open to receiving all the blessings you have in store for me. Thank you, God. Prayer point number two. Dear God, today I declare love and harmony in all of my relationships. I radiate love and attract amazing people who support and uplift me. May my friendships and connections be filled with joy, positivity, and purpose. Amen and thank you, Father. Prayer point number three. Heavenly Father, guide me in my career journey. I declare an employment or new business breakthrough. New doors are opening. And my dream job is just around the corner, Lord. I have the skills, the confidence, and the opportunities to shine. Thank you, Lord. Prayer point four. Dear God, grant me wisdom and clarity in tough decisions. I declare that I make wise choices, leading to my personal growth and happiness. Open the eyes of my understanding, Lord. Teach me discernment. Let me see. Let me know. Thank you, God, for guiding me in the right direction. Thank you and amen. Prayer point number five. Dear God, today I declare healing and strength in my mind, body, and soul. I release any negativity and embrace positive energy. I am filled with vitality and radiate wellness to everyone around me, Lord. Thank you for the gift of my health. Amen. Prayer point six. Dear God, I declare spirit-led creativity flowing through me like a wild river. I am inspired and empowered to express myself in unique ways. Bless my talents and passions, and may they touch the lives and bring joy, God. Let the work of my hands praise your holy name. Amen. Prayer point seven. Dear God, I declare grace, mercy, peace, and purpose in my life. I let go of worries and anxieties, trusting that everything happens for a reason in your perfect timing, Lord. I am on a journey to greatness and my purpose is unfolding right before my eyes. I know that you have seen the end. I trust you. Thank you and amen. Prayer point eight. Dear God, I declare renewed childlike faith and a special encounter with you. I trust your plans, let go of my worries, and embrace the journey towards greatness. I am open to experiencing your love and guidance like never before. Thank you, Lord, for leading me on a purposeful path. 
Amen. Prayer point nine. Dear God, I embrace the grace to know you more intimately each day. I dedicate time to seek your presence, to delve into your word, to grow in understanding of how you think. I hunger for a deeper relationship with you. Thank you, Lord, for what you are doing in my life and the lives of my loved ones. Amen. Sanctify my heart, Lord, and guide me on the path of righteousness. Tone down my flesh, Lord. Amplify my spirit, man. I open my heart to receive your wisdom and love. Strengthen me to a life that honors you in every way. Remove, O oh Lord, anything that takes me away from you. Prune me, Lord. You say in your word that your spirit prunes. Prune me, Lord. Give me the grace to bear your fruit. Amen. Prayer point number 10. And Lord, you said on the cross that it is finished. Thank you for the gift of salvation. May you continue to remind me that this is the most important thing I will ever chase in my life. My salvation. My place with you on the last day when you come. Thank you, God, for everything. Thank you for my family. Thank you for everything that you've done for me. Everything that you've been to me. I glorify you. I worship you. I adore you. And I place all of these prayers that I have prayed today, God. In Jesus' name, amen.